This is Thai ball big noodle. Beef. Whoa. Mmm. Mmm. Nice and soft. Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today I want to share an amazing experience my wife and I had while exploring Bangkok. It was a super hot day and we were looking for a way to cool down. That's when we found Cyan Midtown Mall. As soon as we walked in, the air conditioning hit us. Nice and cool. While walking around, we saw a sign pointing to the street food floor in the basement of the mall. Hungry and curious, we decided to check it out. Going down the escalator, we found a busy food court with the delicious smell of Thai food everywhere. It was a food lover's dream. After looking around, we found a small restaurant selling Thai boat noodles. Yes, that's exactly what I was looking for. I looked at the name and it was the same name as the popular one by Victory Monument. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Pranakon Boat Noodle. For those of you who don't know, Thai boat noodles are a traditional dish from Thailand's floating markets. They come in small bowls with rich broth, tender meat, and fresh herbs. Yes, you have to try it. Oh, dessert. Oh, no. oh here it comes. Hey. I'm I love. Wow. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Wow. Tiny boat. Mini Thai boat. Ningong bus enough. Twenty baht. Okay. This is less than a dollar. All right. First Thai boat in Thailand. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's so good. Thank you. Uh, fish, or what are these? Fish meatballs? Fish ball. So that's one bite. This is bite number two. Mm. That is delicious. First Thai boat. And that is so fulfilling. Mm. I'm happy. This is more like a dry noodle. Cooked dry noodle. Mm -hmm. This is pork dry noodle. Now you don't need to add spice, it's already spicy enough already. <laughs> Cheers to you guys. Mm. It's different, dry. Not like that. Um, very nutty, like a lot of um, peanut. But it's very refreshing. Two bites, and it's gone. Mm. Next bowl. This is the tom yum. Now you can get it rice noodle, vermicelli noodle, glass noodle, or rice wine noodle, which is the flattening guys. Cheers. Of course, this is more like a seafood si uh, flavor. 
again, about two to three bytes, all gone. 20 baht, which is less than a dollar. Mm. That is so good. Cheers. Four bow and I'm full. Mm. Mm. More on the vinegar side. Sweet and sour. Good amount of spice. Just perfect. Again, two bites. Mm. I just want to order like 10 of these, but some more. <laughs> Fish ball. Yep. Mmm, that's delicious, nice and soft, very fresh, love it. All right guys, this is Taibo Big Noodle, beef, whoa. Nice and soft. Noodle delicious. I love how they put the moon in glory with that. This is delicious. Mm. Good, huh? Very good. Out there. <laughs> okay, now my turn. Eh, we're not Dali, Gou Tai, or Yi Tai. And for the bill, then we have Jiu Duan, nine dollars. Pay for the plus the plus bar. Okay, no, we got drinks there. Everything come out to nine dollars. Not bad, not bad, and I love it. This place is in a shopping mall. Um, in the MRT center somewhere, but I'll put the link below. And it's called uh, Pranakon Boat Noodle. Downstairs in a shopping mall. Nice, full AC, relaxing. So on a hot day, you want to eat good pho with good AC, this is the place to be. All right. Um, shout out to Nate Salinsatu. Thank you. Uh, keep following and keep uh, uh, checking out my eating journey and traveling journey. Shinji Nato. This video is sponsored by Lotus Kitchen, located in Fresno, California. Here you can enjoy a special mix of Vietnamese, Lao, Thai, and Cajun dishes. Come taste the unique flavors that makes this place special. At Lotus Kitchen, every dish has its own story. Did you know that this place is one of Fresno's top Southeast Asian cuisine, decorated with awards and community recognition? They are not just famous for their Thai boat, pho, papaya salad, and express hot food, but they are also known for their popular Chinese and Thai dishes. When you're craving for a fusion of Lao Thai and Chinese flavor, La Kitchen is the place to be in Fresno.